News 5 investigates a vacation nightmare. A 72 year old woman from Texas left stranded at the Greyhound bus station in Mobile on her way to a family gathering in Pensacola. WKRG News 5's Lexa Daly joins us now live in Pensacola at the bus stop at the Circle K there where the woman finally reached her destination, but not without another setback, Alexa. Yeah, Genovia Johnson says not only did the bus pull away without her, it left with her luggage still on board. When Genovia Johnson left Baytown, Texas on a Greyhound bus on August 8th, she told the bus driver how excited she was about her family reunion in Pensacola. But after a stop in Mobile, things took a turn. While trying to get back on the bus, the 72 year old says she had trouble pulling her booking information back up for the bus driver. Giving the driver her name and number didn't help either. She said, I don't have time. I'm going to leave you. I'm going to leave you. Johnson finally put up her ticket information, but claims the driver took off. Her luggage sitting on the bus. I'm saying, where my luggage? She gone. Jumped on that bus and backed up. Johnson then waited around at the Mobile Greyhound station for hours. Nobody helping me or anything. And I tell you, my heart was fluttering and, and like I say, swollen. And nobody would, no one would come and help me. Four hours later, she got on another bus and made it to Pensacola. But she says dealing with customer service to find her baggage was no easy task. I said, well, where's the corporate office? He said, the corporate office is in India. India? What about down here in the United States? What about this? You mean to tell me we talking to somebody in India? What we going to do about our luggage? That luggage carrying some important items. My medicine, my life alert, it's, um, narcos are in there, what I take, and I want it, and I want all of my, this is what I'm telling them, I want all of my stuff. This is very important to me. Finally, Tuesday, Johnson was told that her bag was found in Orlando and it will be shipped to her. Johnson is now back in Texas, but this time she skipped the bus and rode back with a family member. I reached out to Greyhound for comment on why Johnson was left in Mobile. They apologized for what she experienced, but didn't have any answers. Live in Pensacola, Alexa Daly, WKRG News 5.